We are wide awake here on the morning sip. And when you normally think about penguins, you think of the ones in cold weather, like in Antarctica. But this is an African penguin that thrives <laughs> in the warm weather. And Pumpkin, thank you for joining <laughs> us. And this is curator Diana Major. Diana, thanks so much for joining us. And tell us more about Pumpkin. Yeah, so Pumpkin is a three-year-old female African penguin. She's one of 11 that we here have here at our colony at Mississippi Aquarium. And actually, uh, Pumpkin doesn't live here at the aquarium. She lives off-site. Correct, yeah. She lives in our aquatic research center where most of our ambassador animals live. Mm -hmm. And how did she get here? So these guys, all of our colony was hatched at another zoo. Um, they've been with us for just about three years now as part of our ambassador collection. And she is actually a protected species? Yes, yeah, so African penguins are an endangered species. Um, their numbers are steadily decreasing, unfortunately, mostly due to overfishing, habitat loss, and climate change. Mm -hmm. So what can we do to, to help the species out? Absolutely, yeah. You can um, make sure you're eating sustainable seafood, making sure we're recycling and reducing our plastic consumption and just being good citizens of the earth, and then supporting organizations that support African penguins out in the wild. Mm -hmm. And I had no idea when I was doing my own research just how many species of penguins are out there. Yes, there's 18 species total. They're found exclusively in the Southern Hemisphere, but on every continent south of the equator. So there's penguins in South America, Africa, like these guys, Australia, New Zealand, um, and then of course the Antarctic species that you typically think of. And you can actually do penguin encounters out here and just get a up close look at them and do meet and greets. And she has a lot of personality. So let's, let's see her out and about just exploring. Yeah, you can put her down. She can explore a little bit. <laughs> there she goes. Just look at her walk. She is just so adorable. Pumpkin, you just love taking this all in. You are so cute. Now, thank you so much for, for sharing this with us and just her unique coloring. I, I, she has the spots on her chest there. That's just makes they're all different with that, right? Yeah. So it's like a fingerprint or a tiger stripe. So it's one of the ways that, uh, penguins can tell each other apart is a spot pattern on their belly and that spot pattern will be their pattern for the rest of their lives. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, thank you so much, Diana, for sharing this with us. We have enjoyed <laughs> popping and there she goes, just run it away. <laughs> there. <laughs> All right, Pumpkin. Well, we love you. We're just going to enjoy more time with you because this is just a once-in-a-lifetime thing. All right. We'll be right back.